Hello, we are Beth McGowan and Nora Jimenez from NIU's Rare Book Room. We want to introduce you to our Common Press. Built by NIU industry and technology student Joe Frieders in 1976, our press replicates the press Benjamin Franklin would have used. It is called a Common Press because it was the standard printing press used across Europe and the US from the 1400s until about 1800. This press created a communications revolution in the Western world, but to do so, it needed two other inventions. The first of these other inventions was movable type. Movable type is comprised of individual letter forms that can be arranged to say anything. Here we see a composing stick with a single line of type. This line of type is placed into a metal frame called a chase with other lines of type. The type is held tightly together by means of wooden blocks called furniture. The second invention was the manufacture of paper from cotton and linen rags. These three elements together, press, movable type, and paper, combine to create the printed page. Back in the day, to make a print on our common press, you would have used ink balls to apply ink to the typeface. We are using a brayer and rolling a layer of ink across the type. Next, you place paper in what we call a tin pan and then lie it down on top of the type, lying in the bed. We roll this under the platen with our rounds and pull the devil's tail. This puts pressure on the type and prints the page. This concludes our presentation on how a common press works. Thank you for watching.